Hey, this is Mike. Hey, this is Joe. And we're doing a very anticipated hobby follow-up. Okay, so today we're going to finish the uh, popsicle house by making a popsicle roof. And by doing that, we're going to do a process called notch cutting. I think we explained in the previous video. But no, I, I cut that out. Okay, well, we'll do it again. And um, yeah, we'll go from there. Okay, so now we're doing the uh, popsicle roof. And so from here, we're going to do notch cutting. And basically, what you want to do is uh, we have two sticks here. You know, we're going to put them together like that. You want to measure out so you can have a basis for cutting. What I'm doing here is putting a popsicle stick on top of another one and drawing a horizontal line right, right here and flipping it over on top so we have I can draw another line so, so you, get, you get a stick's width of length in between the lines so you'll get something like this and then do it for the other stick and you'll have the two cuts here and here and you want to cut them halfway on both. We'll, we'll explain cutting later. Okay, fine. And that's that. Okay, I'm going to explain how you want to cut your popsicle sticks. Uh, you drew, you basically just cut down the two lines that you drew with the pencil. Cut straight down about halfway through the stick. And just make, be careful not to break the popsicle stick while cutting because they're they crack really easily so very careful cuts halfway through and then there's going to be a little bit left that's stuck in there you're going to want to use your scissors to kind of poke that out to get a nice nice even even hole and you're going to want to do that with the other one and I will show you what to do after that okay so after you've made your cuts you'll be able to stick the popsicle sticks together using the slots and you're going to want to make sure it's cut so they fit perfectly together with no no gaps in between <laughs> and then so you're gonna you're gonna make eight of these pieces eight of these pairs 16 popsicle sticks in total and so you can see how this will be the roof um then you're gonna want to line them up like we're doing here so they're all um yeah the hands are, so they're all lined up nice and even can you, Okay, and then you're going to take an extra popsicle stick and we're going to want to glue it to all these other ones as supports. Okay. Um, here. And so line up them all eight in a row, line them up perfectly. And you're going to probably, they need to hang off an edge if you want to line them up smoothly. Okay, um, <laughs> wow, okay, now, <laughs> glue this somehow. This is going to require two people, give you a heads up about that. Or, or, or many people. Okay, here, hold all of them like this. Get this out of the way. <laughs> okay. Line it up, perfect. Yeah, you do that, I'm going to do this one. Okay, I think this is perfect. <laughs> Then you want to put the glue, put the glue on the popsicle stick. I like so that's gonna support. Or not. Make it heavy because you, you know it's gonna have to support all of these popsicle sticks. If not, you can just add another one underneath that one for you know, more support, I guess. But I think one stick should be fine. So we got this, and then. Put it in the group. And 
try to apply pressure and then apply the pressure so they all stick. Okay, after much trial and error, we are deciding that this is how we're going to apply pressure to the glued stick to keep them glued. Okay, so we finished gluing both uh, the wooden popsicle sticks onto our roof. So now it stays in shape just fine. And final step is to put it on your house. You can do that. <laughs> okay. <coughs> okay.